Hey guys, welcome to another Server Miner plugin tutorial. I'm your host LTGym007, and today we look at the Axe Rank Menu plugin. So, as the name would suggest, this plugin allows you to have a menu that players can open to purchase higher ranks. It can show the price and the different permissions associated with each one. It's easily customizable and overall a great and lightweight plugin. So to get started, we can either do forward slash ax rank menu or just shorten it to forward slash rank. Once we've opened it, it will show any ranks that you have. So what I've done is create a few to show you. We've got the player rank, the pro rank, the legend rank, and you can see the price is going to differ for all of them and the permissions will as well. Now, if you want to purchase one, it's as easy as just clicking one and then you'll be given that rank and that will give you the associated permissions with it. If you have additional ranks you want to add, you can do forward slash rank add rank and then there's one called default, which um, I didn't edit at all. But if you do it using the in-game command and then go back to the rank menu, it's going to pop up in the top left corner. It's not going to show anything, a minus one price. So you'll want to go into the config file to edit that. So here we are in the SMPitnik control panel. You can see there's a few YML files. The ranks.yml is where we're going to start. Up at the top, we can set the title, how many rows GUI is, the type of container that we're using. And then this is where it's going to list all of the ranks. So what you can do is copy and paste an existing one, which is what I did. Or if we look down here, this is where it's stuck the new one default. Um, and you could obviously customize that. So what I'm gonna do is copy and paste the legend one and create one for another rank that I have and jump back in after that. So I've just added a new rank that you can purchase. I made this one earlier with luck perms, which is the permissions plugin that is required for this plugin. And you can see, make sure you change the slots so they don't overlap. Uh, I changed the price, the currency, and then you can change the various name and law if you want to. And then permissions, it's also automatically going to grab any permissions associated with it and display it below. All right, so now that we're back in game, we can do the rank reload command. And hopefully if we do forward slash rank now, it is going to show our king rank. So you can see it's got additional permissions compared to the other ones. It's got a new price. We've customized the color of it and we didn't touch the default one at all. So that's still up there looking a bit awkward. And what we can do is purchase it if we have enough and we do. And it says you have purchased the king rank and I will now have all those associated permissions with it. So here we are on the speaker page. You can see it's updated from 1.18 to 1.21 and there's plenty of good information here as well as a wiki and discord if you need further assistance. Once again from our Tilex Studios, a great developer. I've reviewed basically all of their plugins. But if you need a server to host it on, check out serverminer.com for the best and cheapest hosting around. That's it for me. Subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.